At Tesco, our four R strategy means that when it comes to plastic and packaging, we remove it where we can, reduce it where we can't, reuse more and recycle what's left. This gives us a clear path to eliminating unnecessary waste across our own business and encouraging our customers, colleagues and suppliers to consider their own environmental footprint too. I'm Will Guest, Sustainable Packaging Manager at Tesco. We want to support our customers to recycle soft plastics which cannot be recycled at home. That's why working with Plastico Wood and Veolia, we're able to turn soft plastics back into useful products. Hi, my name is Simon Futcher, I'm the Commercial Business Development Director at Veolia. I've been working with Tesco now for just under two years in terms of full managed waste services, working across the three and a half thousand stores and distribution centres. And we've worked very closely to come up with some innovation to solve a challenge around soft plastics. We currently take around 2,000 tonnes a year, but there's certainly capacity to take more. And we do certainly encourage shoppers to bring their soft plastics back into store so they can be reprocessed. I'm Darren Northcott, Director at Plastico Wood. And at Plastico Wood, essentially what we do, we take the waste and we turn it into an eco-friendly building material and we sell it as fencing, lumber, boardwalks, picnic tables, you name it. Whenever we're looking to recycle materials, we're obviously always looking to move it up the waste hierarchy. This is a fantastic solution and certainly serves a purpose for long life products, but as we're looking to innovate, we want to place more onto the circular economy. Turning our customer collected soft plastic into items like picnic benches and planters is a great way of turning waste into something new. We're continually learning, testing new ideas and looking for new opportunities when it comes to plastic and packaging, so watch this space.